Hi guys, I'm Savannah. I'm just going to show you guys today how to watercolor with food dye. It's going to look like this when we're done. Which I might use some different colors because I have to admit these colors together are not the prettiest. So we'll just use a f these are This is every color food dye that I have, but I'm not going to use every color today. So... I've just got a place right here that I work on. That way nothing gets on my dresser. And I've got a scrap sheet of paper right here, like this. I don't use this anymore. I won't need this. I'm just using it as an example. And the words will make it look nice. So first, okay, what I'm going to be using today, the liquids, is probably, I'll use blue food dye green food dye, and just a bottle, an old bottle full of water, okay? I've made sure that this is water. Okay, so first we're going to take our paper. Sorry, I don't really have a nice angle here, but hopefully you can see that. We're going to take our paper and we're going to spritz it with the water, just all over. Okay, now we're going to take our first food dye, and we're just going to make a drop here and there. See, I don't know if you see this, but it's already spreading. Then we're going to take our food dye number two, Oops. make a drop here and there. Okay, now I know you're like, how's that going to watercolor, but then we're going to take this our water again and spray right on top of the dots again and spray kind of around it again that way when you tip it up it will run like this you see and then sometimes it'll get stuck and again just need to keep spraying it it takes a lot of water to do this but it's okay because in the end it still looks good And just tilt it around until you're done and then let it just drip off or whatever however you want to do just one second okay now I'm just gonna spray a little bit more water see and it's still running like this then sometimes I like to um, Fold it over and get it everywhere, you know. Nice and good. And that's the finished product. And I also have um, sprays that I mixed with all you do is mix water with food dye and I'm just gonna kind of dry this a little bit and I'm just gonna spray over it with a red oh wait, a red's empty basically I use green I take a green spray just water and food color and then spritz here and there And then you can always rub this in with your finger because it will come off right off. But yeah, so you can use this on any paper that you want a watercolor on. Thanks for watching!